Hello there, Starth Paradigm. I'm about to show you some day blades that I received today from uh, Downside Up Customs, their Etsy store. And uh, well, they kind of specialize in a lot of things. But for me, uh, the thing that they provided was day blades. And uh, so I received two enhanced day blades. This of course is the red. I have it installed on my uh, my Scorch. This is my Dominix V5. Has the uh, blazing red LED. Just the uh, single Cree variety. And uh, this is one of my favorite sun hilts. And so I wanted to get something uh, that was a little bit lighter. This is uh, the thin walled version. 32 inch variety. Uh, please note when I received it, the uh, diffusing film was a little bit uh, crunched up on the inside. They rolled it up and they installed it and on the very inside it was crunched up and it showed up as uh, blemishes inside the blade. So what I had to do was I had to remove the diffusing film, reverse the curl, kind of flatten it out. I didn't really cut off the damage bits, but I, I just tried to install it into the blade and uh, the end results um, were not too bad, not too bad at all. So I have, um, the lights are all on, but it is nighttime and I'm dodging my cat who seems to have gone upstairs. So that's actually helpful. <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna show you what this thing looks like in the light and then I'll turn off the lights and you can get kind of a feel for how this one looks in the dark. And then I'll do the same thing for my blue, uh, for the blue blade that I received. So, here you go. So this is kind of a low light situation. And uh, it really, what, what it does, the effect is, it, it kind of takes the, uh, it kind of takes the LED and the red and just makes it pop. It saturates and it just kind of, it, it just, it gives it kind of a real lustrous color. It's really hard to see on the camera to be sure, always is. So I'm sure someone's gonna, whoops. <laughs> so let me turn the light off. Very nice indeed. I am quite pleased with how this uh, with how this looks. Look, he's back and underfoot. There we go. So let's move on to the next hill. This is my shock LE. Uh, this one's name is Nascent Light. And this has a uh, Guardian Blue LED installed. Again, just single, uh, single Cree. Note the weathering. Very nice, very nice. And has this really nice kind of pale, subtle blue finish to it. Well, once you turn it on, you get the richest of blues. Now, for me, uh, the reason why I wanted to get an enhanced day blade for these two hilts, and I love stun savers and I love these two hilts, is I have a story uh, for nascent light that really needed, uh, I, I kind of wanted the blue to really saturate and pop and just appear as, as absolutely blue as it can. Uh, kind of goes with the story that I've created for it. One of the weird effects here is the the light really kind of starts to it's 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 a lot brighter up here. It's less blue, kind of turns into more of a pale blue on the tip. It's an interesting effect. I I know that that would probably annoy some people. I find it rather endearing and it adds to the character of the saber. So uh, let's get the lights out. Okay. Let's see if we can get the 
this point. Let's get both of them. Kind of makes it even more uh, obvious when they're together exactly how saturated the colors are. Now, <laughs> I'm a complete noob with uh, day blades. I only have two other day blades, and to be perfectly honest, I don't think they're really that good. But. There's going to be more of these in my future. Indeed, I'm going to be buying uh, photon blades and uh, more uh, transweight blades from from this company. I'm rather fond of transweight blades. If indeed, if if I had my choice, I would use either transweight blades or um, I'm actually kind of a fond of just the normal. Uh, Ultra Saber's mid-grade blades, they they give a wonderful sort of very much like Star Wars of Rebels kind of effect to the blades and I, and I do like the way those look and uh, the Ultra Edge blades are, are good but um, as far as uh, you know just getting the, the best color that you can I, I always like Transweight blades and these are sort of the uh, the day blade version of, of Transweight blades if that makes any sense which it doesn't <laughs> So anyway, uh, yeah, so that's uh, Downside Up Customs. I'll put the link to the Etsy store, and uh, I highly recommend them. They're they're very decent price for, uh, for day blades. And uh, yeah. What more can I say? <laughs> so hopefully you enjoyed uh, this video and found it informative. Uh, so if uh, if that is the case, uh, please like or dislike uh, whatever floats your boat. And if you could subscribe, that would be totally awesome. I really appreciate that. And if you have any questions, please feel free to comment. So I will uh, see you next time with some more content. And I hope everyone has a wonderful, uh, well, a wonderful rest of the week. Take care now. Bye.